Yesterday, we had this woman, her name is Mary, 83 years old, super sweet lady. It's kind of spunky, too. Mm -hmm. You know how yeah. older ladies can be spunky, like they've already put up with everybody's crap, and now they're done. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> she was spunky. She had some life. She was a believer. And uh, she comes out the door, and we engage her like this. She goes, oh, I, be I believe, and, and I love Jesus and all this. And so um, uh, I noticed she's got her, her right arm kind of up like this the whole time. And, uh, and she goes, I need healing. And so uh, I'm like, what's going on with you? She says, well, five months ago, my right shoulder dislocated. Mm -hmm. And have you ever seen people whose shoulders dislocate? It's that, gross. Like there is a way to put it in, but it's you have gross. to have help and you have to like mm -hmm. ram it back in. Or sometimes people have surgery for these things. I don't know, but it's painful mm -hmm. and uh, it doesn't. Uh, always go back in by itself. And in this case, she had, it had been dislocated for five months. And she's, and uh, so we asked her, you know, what kind of pain are you experiencing? And we give a scale of 10 is the most pain and zero is no pain. Where are you at? She said, uh, I'm at a nine, mm -hmm. like at a constant nine. And uh, she says, I basically do not use this arm anymore. Mm -hmm. So 83 year old Mary in her, um, in her little uh, duplex living, she lives on her own. Um, and she is suffering. She's got this arm. It's dislocated. Nine out of ten pain. And um, and so I just said, hey, you know what? I gave her some testimonies. And she, she starts weeping. Yes, yes, I believe. And I put my hand on her shoulder. And I commanded to be healed in the name of Jesus. And, uh, and immediately she just begins to completely break down and weep. And sits down in her little chair there on her porch. And she and I said, uh, I said, Mary, what's going on? She says, she says, oh, it's so much better. And she starts trying to move it like this. And she go, I said, well, where are you at pain wise? She said about a one. So it went from a nine to a one immediately. Mm -hmm. And usually when that happens, sorry, I'm having trouble hearing you. Yes, yes we know that is. Siri. <laughs> I got to turn that girl off. Uh, here's what's happening. It's not that uh, healing didn't fully take place. But healing is happening in just moments. And when it goes from like a 9 or a 10 to 1 like that, that means that things are being mended on the inside. Mm -hmm. Things are being put back together. And what she's experiencing is that process. Yeah. And if we didn't say anything else, it will go to a zero in just a few moments. Okay? So we're not, we're not like worried about that or anything. We just start talking to her and she's, she's crying and weeping, thanking us. She's like, you have no idea what this means to me uh, because she's getting her arm back. She's in the process of getting her mobility back, her life back. And, uh, and she starts, you know, uh, you know, we're just loving her and hugging her and she's hugging us. And, and she, and Levi, our 12 year olds there. And he's, he's kind of adolescent age mm -hmm. coming in almost a teenager. So he's got fat cheeks that are real squishable and kissable to the old ladies. <laughs> oh my God. And she's kissing his cheeks and hugging him and hugging us. She, she hugged us all like two or three times. I said, Mary, where are you at with your shoulder? And she goes, well, I think there's still just a little bit. And she goes like this. She goes, oh, it's gone. And it went from nine to zero in just a few moments, mm -hmm. completely healed complete mobility with like a five, 10 second prayer. Jesus is King. Yeah. So that's our outreach. And, and you know what we did for her entire neighborhood? We tell, we told her testimony to everyone mm -hmm. right over there. See that car? That's Mary's car. She's 83. She's yeah. been at a level nine out of 10 pain for five months and she had no use of her right arm and she was instantly healed. I love because people's faces are like, ah, they, all of a sudden they're in conflict with truth and light coming in. We preached to Muslims yesterday in that neighborhood, and we were telling them, and they're like, well, my, I have some facts that differ from yours. I'm like, I'm not dealing in facts. I'm no. dealing in truth, man. And anyway, it was an incredible day, but go into the city and heal the sick therein. And that's, that was Mary's story yesterday. Got her herself back. Yeah. Got her arm back.